everything. But you forgot that videotape we made. How do you know about that? Aren't you Maria? Fart face. See a fart face! Laura! Laura! here so we're switching back here and i just the, i want to note i never noticed in the original that they swing down and are holding onto the ceiling with their hand but you guys have taken that to another level um talk about what's changed here obviously a lot i saw a lot has a lot and a lot needed to be changed obviously because like one thing was the first person camera the second thing was the the you know uh, scale of the room that we needed to change and we also knew that we want to, you know, to expand on the idea, right? So keeping the original design of the monster was like super crucial, right? We, we wanted to go as close as possible, but at the same time, we were just looking at this monster and we were thinking about like, okay, what, what can we do more, right? And yeah. if we have like those two spaces, the ceiling and the, you know, the space when James is, uh, we, we were thinking that, okay, let's, let's, let's just move it dynamic, right? Let's just go up and down. Let's just, you know, create like this tension, tension moment, like during the fight. So you, you would not expect what, the, what is, what is happening here. And what I personally really like with, 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 with our version is that we, we, we split it into phases, like very obvious phases. And, uh, you, you are not expecting what will happen during this first phase uh, in the future. Like, you, you see that you are breaking this cage, you yeah. are kind of a little bit opening, like, the, the original design, and, you know, you already have, like, uh, you know, small parts of his, uh, you know, arms, you know, trying to hit you, but I don't think, like, anyone would expect what will happen next, right? Mm. And it, it's it's also, also, like, it was very important for us to to not rely only on, on, on rage weapons. You yeah. wanted to, if, if you have, like, this mechanic of melee, Oh my gosh! Yeah. And yeah. This is this moment we're looking yeah. at this, and, and you're, what you're saying, yeah, about uh, being able to use melee weapons more effectively in here, whereas you saw the original was was more about using ranged. But man, guys, talk about what you did here with this boss. Like it's it's completely different. Yeah, it is, and it was all, all obviously you know something that we were we've been talking a lot. If we if you want to go that route to kind of change the design into some kind of a spider, obviously. Yes. But I think it, it is nice because we are keeping this idea throughout the, the entire game. I don't want to spoil anything more, but right. it's, it's basically something that we uh, that we wanted to introduce uh, to, to, to it. Uh, obviously, you know, talking to, to, to original creators, etc. And and I think it's, it's pretty nice and it, it can surprise even the, you know, love that stuff. It looks so cool. The way, the, I mean, even before the ceiling is wrecked and you see the ceiling tiles rippling as it's running through, um, and you're breaking apart the cage, which you think would be a good thing, but it turns it into this even more limber foe. Uh, and then here we go, James has is, is succeeded for now. Um, but uh, yeah, just what a, what a great expression of a very cool original, you know, boss concept, and then sort of brought to uh, a, a new a new level. Um, that's so cool, guys. Um, yeah, if you if you expected to see two flesh leaps, like here you go. Is it and uh -huh. the punch. <laughs> there it is. You're not safe from the grab attack. That's going to bring us to the end here. There's so much more we could say, but um, Mateusz and Andre, I just wanted to say thank you for joining us um, for this look at Silent Hill 2, the remake and the original. The remake is coming out uh, October 8th, 2024 on PS5. Not long to wait. Thank you.